Hello everyone, I'm Greg Luke, thank you for joining me, and welcome back to episode 323 of Factorio with Angels and Bob's Mods. And just between you and me, can I just say, I've already tried recording this episode thrice, no twice before this, sorry, two times before this. So I might be going over what we're going to do a little bit fast this time. Uh, but that just saves you time, I guess. So, we're still working on sodium hydroxide, and we want to make this a little bit more effective, because scaling this is just taking so much space. And I did find some ways to improve this a little bit, by basically moving these up further and moving this away. So, let's work on that. So, we push all of the water to a storage tank. Because then we can have a lot more. Pushing to this machine. Whoops. Something like that. Four times the amounts. Good. Then we still need this in here. But since we're moving these beacons up, we also need to move this up because these won't reach from up here somewhere otherwise. So we move that up, put in some bumps here. Actually, let's just put bumps here as well. Or as much throughput as possible. We output the sodium hydroxide down here. Sure. All the way around though. And then we I guess we pump into here. Yeah, why not? And then another water tank over there. Some water moving around this. Good. And Pump it up here into some barreling pumps. You will barrel this. No, not saline, 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 saline. But hydrogen. You will barrel up the thorium. Okay. And I think that's it. And then we need to move these up here. We need to move all of this out of the way. It's just going up here for now at least. Uh, whoops. Let's remove or remove any extra scene. And Provide these actively to get them out of there. Thank you. And then we move this up here, I guess. Same with this. We need some power there now. I'm gonna reserve this spot for making more of the electrodes we need down here. I don't really want this to be too far away for power though. I don't want to have to add this, but let's just do it. Reserve that spot there. Good. And then we can just move this up here, I guess. Why not? And then these just get there. And stop testing stuff to that one.
weird, so we have this blueprint we can use when we have removed this. Also, we should expand this. Then expand on. Um... Wait, what? Where is the blueprint for this? No, oh, I haven't even taken it yet, I guess. My bad. And then this just slips in there nicely. All of this, of course, generates a lot of gas, so we need to take care of that more. We have too much hydrogen. And we're just gonna move around down here a little bit. So let's remove this. Remove this. Then we're gonna move that in close here, and then we have the clarifiers on this side and burning on this side. I guess we can just make the burning anyway right now. We're just gonna duplicate everything because these player stacks can easily keep up, so to utilize them a bit more, we make a double setup like this. Shouldn't I? Oh, I have the... Yeah, that's hydrogen. Okay. And we need even more hydrogen burning than this, so let's just continue this. And we need more beacons and modules. And we need to move this in. Cut it, please. In there. Request that again. Good. Let's go and grab these. I, don't know, I guess we can just ask the train to deliver. As long as it gets some first. It has what it needs, okay. I guess we want to expand on this as well. Of course, we need cleaning of the electrodes and to create even more electrodes as well. We shall fix that. Good. So let's start with the cleaning. I just gotta do that in line with all of this, I guess. I did it like this, let's just try it. So we need purified water in. And then we need two liquids out. One of them is water, which we're just gonna clarify. So you unbarrel purified water. Yes, please.
you at Bitcoin will provide the empty barrels. The input. How did I do this again? We need both a solid input and output, but we can't have that right now unless we use this at a weird angle. Well, we can just do that, I guess. And then we bottle up mineralized water. And then we make a train station to get rid of that, but we also need some clarifying of it, I guess. This will be mineralized water. So you are getting some of that good. To provide the empty barrels. Good. Still like some saving water, but that's fine. Then we are actually cleaning these electrodes now. Good. Then we just need to make some more because we don't have enough for these as soon as we get a little bit more sodium hydroxide. And we will get a little bit more of that as soon as these chests are full. So let's start producing more electrodes. We need carbon for that, and I guess we should just go and grab some. And I just say, we've already achieved more than I did in the first half hour when I tried doing this. Just because I didn't think too much about how we did things. Carbon is why I'm here. How many do we get out of a thousand carbon? One thousand. Mm, I'm not sure if that is enough. But this is so dang slow. Also, we need more steel. Lots and lots of stuff. You should only output if we have less than a hundred available. Waiting for sodium hydroxide. The fluids seem to be doing okay. Maybe. Maybe we have too much chlorine. It doesn't really look like it though. I guess we can scale this up even further if we want to. Let's just do that. Should have the water blueprint here. Yep. Let's not kill ourselves done that way too many times. And we need more water fill. Water goes in there. That.
Let's just keep this here for a bit. I guess. We want to expand this way as well. Oh, we already have this. Oh. Be accurate. Thank you. My bad. But now we have too much chlorine at least. Let's burn all. I think we're good on water film here for now. Do we want to expand a little bit more up here? Come on. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Let's leave it at that though. We are producing way more than we have ever done at the moment. As you will be able to see in here, if we look back a little bit, almost 10,000 per minute, as opposed to the 1200 ish we made earlier. Now we're not burning the hydrogen fast enough. That should help a lot. Hopefully. As long as these are blinking, they are working, I guess. Apparently, we still have too much glowing of all things. I think we also do it with this. Let's do this. Are we out of robots or something? They are a bit low. Maybe we should just put more in. Yeah. Stuck on water. Half of these, maybe. Sure. And these are all working full speed at the moment, it seems. So maybe we need even more burning. I also said we needed clarifiers for mineralized water, let's do that. Mineralized water, first limit this. Uh, mineralized water is above 100 barrels actively provide those verify speed up good I think we are okay here for now then next up is when we redid all of these stations, we left some trains behind. So let's see what sort of problems we have. A fuel train. Did we name the fuel station correctly? Yes, we did. So you... 
do not need to go to MIA anymore. But you need to go to sodium processing fuel or M Chicago or time pass five seconds. And you need to do that after production fuel and before robot production fuel. So in here, yeah, that makes sense. Next. Aluminium, sodium hydroxide, you should come to sodium hydroxide instead. Full carbon, done. Lithium ion battery, hydrogen chloride, you should come to hydrogen chloride then. Wait, which one is this? Is it hydrogen chloride or hydrogen chloride gas? Let's say this for now. This is hydrogen chloride. Where is hydrogen chloride gas? Over at the processing. Okay. Do we have any trains actually going there? Which one? Why am I so blind? There's no hydrogen chloride. What's this? I should really... Am I just recent reading it wrong and it's hydrogen fluoride and not hydrogen chloride? Am I that blind again? Yes, I have. I just saw hydrogen and gas and expected it to be chloride, I guess. My bad. This train. No. Let's search for MIA again instead. You need hydrogen chloride as well. All next. See the dish we're not actually using, but we might as well fix this, I guess. Uh, hydrogen chloride, not sodium chloride. Last one, sodium carbonate should go to sodium carbonate at sodium processing empty. Where else is this sodium carbonate going? Multi processing. I'll leave with that for now. Okay, I think we have more trains. Maybe they're just empty though. This is fine, that's the old Jiro light. That has been stopped for quite a while. This is what? Seated dish, I think. That's fine. This is at our multi oh, resource processing. This one. So crystal dust is not going anywhere. It's not even named, so it's probably never gone anywhere. Okay. And then we have some for oh this is my train, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. 
So why is crystal dust not going anywhere? And why are we making it? All in the chests. Is this producing? Yes. But we are also exporting geodes from here. Yep. I think we should tear that down. Or we should just leave it, I guess. That's not really a problem with it. Mm. So I guess we're done here. We have enough sodium hydroxide now. We'll need more electrolyzers. Oh, sorry. Uh, electrodes. Electrolyzer electrodes. Yeah. I guess we could just bring in some more carbon for that. And use some more steel as well. How are we doing on the sodium then? We're actually full, so we're ready for gold processing. And I guess that's the next thing. Unless I forgot something. Let's also put a reader down. Good. I guess it's just gold then. Right. We could also go and do something about this outpost, start importing all of the chunks and stuff. It would take up quite a lot of stations though. Let's just leave it. We have a lot of production down there that we don't want to stop really. processing this what if we need that other than here aluminium and multi processing We really want to get rid of that though. What happens if we run out of sodium carbonate over here? Then we don't have this stuff. Sodium chromate or whatever. Which we need for thermoelectric generators and rockets then, and robots, I think. Yay, I remembered something. Because yeah, those are used in, I think it's satellites, and robots, yep. Okay, what's up next? I guess it's just back to gold. Uh, 
That's why not. We don't have anything in here, right? That we really need. No, just gold. So we're now importing the sodium. How about ammonia? I think I wanted to do that somewhere central. Don't we, didn't we make a nitric acid outpost somewhere? Or did we just... We're making nitric acid here, yeah. Are we exporting that? Yes, we could also export ammonia. Because we're already making that somewhere. Here. And that's pretty expandable. Though it's pretty far away, but yeah. Why not? Let's do that. Let's just put it into its own thing. Ammonia. Curse them, I won't forget. And unfortunately, that's all we have time for in this episode. So thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you next time. Bye.